how to add uh, new fields to uh, reports that we already have created. We have a report here um, and uh, it's based on this query and they ask us to add uh, here uh, new fields. Um, if you you would normally go to add existing fields uh, but those fields are not uh, from the query that we originally created so they're not there. Uh, how do we add them? Uh, the best way don't go to show all tables and add them because it will create another query and you can't control it the best way is to go back to your query uh, on the design you go into the, design, into the design view uh, and you can for example add the field that you wanted I'll add uh, this one okay uh, and then you must save it In, it's important save it so that the query stores that field um, if you go now to the uh, to the field list, you'll see that it's there. Okay, even if you um, you don't want to see it anywhere else, you can do it. You can click on not show. If you click on not show, it's not there. So the important part is to um, if you click on show, you can see it's there. Okay, so you just have to go in, in the report and go to, I had already done this, so go to the field and just drag it, drag it to where you want it and you've got it. Okay, if you go now to the layout view you'll see it, you've got the contact there. Um, we'll add up uh, another field so that you can see it. We'll go to uh, the query, uh, we'll add um, for example the branch state which wasn't here. Uh, yeah, the branch state was here. Um, we'll add not the branch state, then we'll add um, the uh, employee branch, for example, branch code, which is not here. Uh, save it, then we go to the uh, report. You have it here, and you just can drag it. Um, you've got to do, do it under the design view. Go to the design view drag it to where you want and you can then go change the view and you've got it there and you just have to move it around so that's the way to uh, add uh, fields uh, that you want on your report okay hope you like it